Today we're going to be taking a look at the best wiring options for your 2017 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited. Here we have the Kurt, and that's going to be part number C55124. And over here we have the Takancha, which is going to be part number 118416. So here's what our wiring harness is going to look like after we install it. It's going to give us a four pole flat. And it's going to live on the outside of our vehicle. That way it's going to be ready whenever we're ready to tow. Now let's take a closer look at our options. Both of our kits are going to provide us with all the required lighting to get us safely down the road with our trailer. And the differences between the two is very minimal, so I think either kit's going to be a great choice. Now these kits are a little bit different than most other kits. We're only going to be using one connector at the back of our driver's side tail light. Now the way our harnesses are going to connect, they're going to use a T connector that's going to plug into the back of our tail light and we're gonna have a ground that we're gonna need to hook up on both kits. Now both our kits are gonna give us roughly about five feet of wire from our four pole to go from our driver's side tail light all the way routing it down to our hitch. Now once we route them to the outside of our vehicle, they're gonna hook up to our hitch a little differently. The Takancha here is gonna have a permanently attached dust cover, which is nice, but in the event that it breaks, we're not gonna be able to replace it. Whereas with the Kurt, it is removable and replaceable, so we don't have to worry about anything if it does get damaged. Now both kits come with all the necessary hardware to get everything installed, as well as the self-tapping screws for your ground. Now the Kurt does have a little bit of an upper hand here because they do provide you with more zip ties to tie up all your excess wires. One of the really nice things about both of these kits is their simple plug and play installations. We're not gonna have to worry about a converter box and running a wire from that box all the way to our battery. We're simply just gonna plug in our T connector, find a suitable spot for our ground, and then route our wire down. And then I'll finish up the look at the best wiring options for your Jeep Wrangler Unlimited. Click the link below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com.